Hi, welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video on how to remove and replace a VAS V-type visor. Uh, here we've got the RX7V, uh, but this method can be used on a few helmets throughout our eyes range. As always, take a look at the description below and uh, we'll make a list of the compatible models there. So, to get this uh, visor off, first thing we're going to do, open up the visor, like so. Unlike previous uh, generations of our eyes, these side pods are actually attached to the helmet, so we don't have to worry about them falling off. You can see at the side here, there is a black lever. We're just going to push this lever towards the back of the helmet, and this side pod will actually pop off, like so. We'll do the same on this side. There we go, and now we can see the actual mechanism that uh, the visor system uses. We've got a brass button, We've got a red dot. Whether we're removing or replacing the visor, it's all about lining these two up. So from this position to remove the visor, all we're gonna do is close the visor until the red dot and the brass button meet. From there, we can just pick the visor off. Easy as that. So uh, to anyone out there that's had the, the older generations of our eyes, although even myself, I didn't like it to start with. You do get used to it, and actually it is a lot, lot better than the, the old lever release system. So to replace the visor, we're just going to line up. Again, you'll do this both sides at the same time, much, much easier. But this cutout on the visor needs to go over this top screw on the base plate, like so. And then we're gonna line up again the brass and the red button just like that click that over the little retaining part and that side will stay on. Spin it around, I'll show you again on this side. Lining up the brass over the cutout, now to clip over. And then from that position, all you need to do is open the visor and that is it, done. We will then replace the side pods. Always this top part of the side pod needs locating here and then you can just literally just push it and it will click into place like so same on this side top part first and the rest just drops into place you can just give it a little ping with your finger just to make sure it doesn't pop off and there we go so that's how you uh, remove and replace the visor on an rx7v or a vas v type visor used throughout the range thanks for watching